the stretch run of women's basketball upon us with a pair of teams searching for a win. For Xavier, it's been over a calendar year since their last conference victory. For Providence, they're winless since the last time they played the Musketeers a couple weeks ago. And their alternate grays going up against the dark blue of Xavier. And right off the bounce, it's Olivia Olsen going to work. That's a great start for Olsen. She's got to get touches. A lovely addition for Providence. They could get her going. Morales Romero knocks down a three. Yeah, good job. Licked into Olsen into the post. Yeah, that's good pick and roll. Fosa kicks to Archibald. That's a great look. A Fosa dribble penetration. One of those pieces in this rebuild for the Musketeers. New head coach in charge. Shot clock winds down. Purvis gets it off. Archibald with the block from behind. Just putting on the Providence ball handlers. Olsen finishes through contact. And these two teams continue to jockey back and forth with the lead. Run. Ifosa comes up with it. Providence on the break. And Ifosa finishes over the top of Purvis. The Friars on an 11-0 run. Scarlett dribbles all the way in, but she's erased by Olsen. Shocking Daniela Lopez back in with two fouls. They can't keep her on the bench much longer. And Lopez knows she can't defend, so Ifosa takes her right at her. Wow, what a great, great move by Grace Ifosa. And Purvis transferred in from the University of Houston after three seasons there. She helped the Cougars to a couple of WNIT appearances. Carla looks at the rim, drop pass down, Olsen with another denial. Deep into the post for Olsen, who adds to her game high 13 points. And a teardrop altered by Olsen, even though she doesn't get the block shot. Now Fosa kept that rebound alive. Morales Romero absorbs a bump and finishes through the contact. Wow, acrobatic play. Beaver's a team that has not won a Big East game yet this year. So she did talk about this being a must win. She said that Xavier is hungry to the point where it... We'll try another. Yes. Wow. How about Emily Archibald on that sequence? Two offensive rebounds. The assist to Hall is the key. Fryer stepping up today. How about Hall with the dump? Oh. That won't fall. The follow-up will for good measure. Sir Todd Tata probably wish she had made the initial shot, but she'll take the end one. Into the post. Another basket for Sir Tateda. Yeah. She said there were some lean years, and it was those years at Iona that encouraged her. How about McLaughlin's first career basket? Yeah, bench goes crazy. Yeah. Crowd goes crazy. She's got a little bit of a smile. Puts a bow on this one. A 24-point victory for Providence as they snap a four-game losing streak. Yeah, great win for Providence. Great answer coming out of the disappointing Butler effort. Coach Fath said we'd been in a rut. I think the Friars got out of that today. We hope to have Coach Fath for an interview after the game. We'll talk about some of that great defensive effort, that balanced scoring.